You uh, pondered the possibility of changes last night. Uh, can you confirm either way at this point, Sheldon? Yeah, we'll have a couple of changes today. Uh, Mike Sissel will, will come out. Rich Clune will come in in that veteran spot for him. Uh, Kyle Grundstrom will come in the lineup for sure. We don't know who's going to come out here at this point. We got a couple game time decisions, so we'll see how warm up goes there. Is that guys banged up, or just you want a different look? A little bit of both. A little bit of both uh, right now. Like I said, we've got some game time decisions. So we have the veteran issue too. We have to make room for Rich Clune to get him in. Um, so we'll see how warm up goes with the other decision. What do you hope he'll add to the lineup coming in, Clune? Uh, just emotion, energy. Um, the back-to-back -back here coming off of a loss, not as much time to kind of get yourself off the mat and, and feel better about yourself. So he's an emotional leader for our team. Yeah, obviously he didn't play yesterday, so he's fresh. So all those things combined, we felt it was important to get him in. say an emotional leader, but he's really been like a good soldier for you guys, right? Like he's, he's done everything you've asked and he hasn't complained. Yeah, absolutely. You know, he's he's been around for a long time, and he kind of knows we're in a tough situation. He, in turn, is in a tough situation with us. But he's been terrific, and he makes our younger people accountable and pushes them to be at their best, both the guys that are out of the lineup that he's working with every day um, and the guys that are in the lineup, just encouraging and staying on top of guys and, uh, you know, always kind of knowing the temperature of the team, all those kind of things. So, you know, we, we like... We like his emotion and his energy he'll bring today. We think he makes our guys feel better and makes them play better in turn is what we're looking for. So, um, you know, and then on the ice, it's going to give us some energy as well. A few days of practice enough for Grenstrom to get acclimatized? We're going to find out. <laughs> Do you like Rich Clinton's music decisions? I, I, think, I think they're terrific. It's a noticeable difference when he's in the lineup. Is there a tried tested method to, to counter their speed, at least negate it, to get your size going back into transition the other way? Well, you know, I, I think that we feel like we didn't skate at all yesterday, and a lot of that was our own doing. We just didn't put the puck in good spots, and, um, you know, we think there's some things that they did, certainly, but there's a lot of things that we did to just feed into their speed, and we want to negate their speed by by uh, bringing ours to the table today, and the, the quicker the puck moves, the more we can get on top of them. I think that, uh, you know, we'll see more of our team and what we're capable of. Campbell was just talking about kind of tiptoeing into that series against Albany, and then they had a good response after that. Do you expect a similar situation here tonight with a good pushback? I do, and we've been through this. Um, you know, not quite as quick a turnaround, and you know we're we're further along in the playoffs here, and so I think it's a better team here today that has got a little more depth, and they're not going to be easy. Uh, it's not going to be easy for us to push back, but I, I I like what our team went through last series. We responded very well. I have no reason to, to expect anything different than a good performance from our guys today.